The rock and roll legend Roger Waters is being cancelled by the city of Frankfurt. They are calling him the world's most well-known anti-Semites. Of course, it's a lie. Roger Waters has never said anything against Jews or the Jewish people. To the contrary, the man is very well known for his progressive views on so many issues and subjects around the world. And if it's anything, the man is an anti-racist, not a racist. Why then cancel Roger Waters' concert? The reason the concert was being canceled is because of Roger Waters' support for Palestine and the Palestinian people. Israel has succeeded in conflating between anti-Semitism, uh, anti-Jewish racism, and anti-Zionism. Zionism is an ideology. It's an ideology that was actually established in Europe itself during the rise of the racist ideologies and Nazism and fascism in Europe. Zionism has nothing to do with Jews or the Bible or, or history or race. Zionism is a modern political invention and an extremely racist one at that because it's predicated on the idea that the Jewish people anywhere in the world have historic rights in Palestine and the Palestinian people, the original native inhabitants of the land, have no rights at all. Roger Waters is not even delving in, into any of these subjects. He's saying you need to treat Palestinians with respect and Israel needs to be held accountable for its war crimes against the Palestinians. And the international community needs to enforce international law regarding Israeli apartheid and military occupation. What's wrong with that? Why does that make him the biggest anti-Semite and the world's most well-known anti-Semite? So let's be very careful before we engage into this topic. It has nothing to do with Semitism and anti-Semitism. It has everything to do with Israel's war crimes against the Palestinians. So we support Roger Waters 100% and we thank him for his solidarity. He continued solidarity, not just with the Palestinian people, with oppressed people all over the world. Rock on Roger. We love you and we believe in you.